Hello, this is Psych Central's Ask the Therapist, and I'm Dr. Marie Hartwell Walker, and this is my colleague, Dr. Dan Tomasulo. And one of the things we were talking about before we started the camera running is the benefits of meditation. Mm -hmm. um, mindfulness has become a bit of a cliche even mm -hmm. in our world, or at least um, in America in the last oh, decade mm -hmm. or so. Right. But um, it's not always clear to people about what exactly it's for. Mm -hmm. And so I thought I'd ask you, Dan, to explain a little bit in, in a, a short way, um, right. what, is, what does meditation do for you? Yeah, I, th I think the, the, the short version of that, and there's lots of different kinds. Mindfulness meditation is just really one type. You know, mm -hmm. there's um, like dozens and dozens and dozens. Uh, but ultimately, they each get back to one point, which is a little bit of a pause for thought so that you start becoming aware that there are things that bubble up inside of you, thoughts, feelings, reactions, all these kind of things that bubble up, and that you do not have to just react to all those thoughts, and that you have external anxieties, uh, stressors that uh, press on you, and the idea that you can create a little bit of a space where you do not just have to react, that space opens up the idea that you can choose the direction you go in. You don't have to try to go in 20 directions, that you can take this half step back and then make a decision about what you're going to do and how you're going to do it. Now, to, to piggyback that strength or that, that cultivation with the idea that that gives you an opportunity to focus on something. Uh, so that if I have 20 things in my head and each of them seem uh, equally valuable or equally distressing and all my energy is being dispersed and I, I, I can't really decide what am I going to do first, what's an important, if I have that half step back where I can feel all of this and then make a, a conscious, deliberate decision about where I'm going to focus my attention, because that's really ultimately what meditation is about, uh, the focusing of your attention. And I said, well, I, you know, I'm going to do this thing now. What happens is all of that energy gets focused on what I'm doing. And that means I'm going to be more effective, more efficient. When you take a look at the long-term studies, actually right down the road here from UMass, mm -hmm. right? Um, uh, since the 70s, they've been tracking people. Everything seems to improve. Everything from, uh, you, you know, your uh, reduction in stress, your capacity for well-being goes up, um, uh, fewer physical problems. Yeah, even health. E everything, because yeah. you're, you're able to deal with the thing that's in front of you first and foremost without all the energy being dispersed.